a little something about Raymond. He's an investor in stocks and rentals. He wants no money from you, no bait and switch, nothing. Here's what he's going to do. He's going to log into his personal account, share real estate property documents, and give you suggestions on what to read. All right. Today is Monday, August 24, 2020, and it's update time. So let me log in. Hopefully everybody is doing good. Today was a decent day for me. I didn't make a killing, but I didn't lose anything. So not complaining. And hopefully you guys made some money or open an account bought some investment property considering buying investment investment property not just thinking about it but actually doing it so let me get in here one of the worst things you can do is just keep saying i'ma do it i'ma do it i'ma do it and never do it <laughs> All right, we are in. And today our update will be on my rollover IRA. So let's go there. And let's go to accounts and positions. And we're in. So today is a good day. I made a little over $400. And as I told you guys in another video, the market technically is still open. So your normal trading hours closed at uh, 4 o'clock. And right now it's 4.35. So technically... I can make more money or lose more money. But right now at this second, it is at $459. And uh, if I don't forget, we're going to look at what it is it's when I get ready to stop this video. But for right now, my current value is one thousand. I'm sorry, 174000 And if it was 1000 I would be, I don't know, something bad. <laughs> A hundred and seventy four thousand two hundred and seventy sixty three cents and let's compare where it was two weeks ago so we're at our website stocks and rentals I want to go to portfolio tracking and find the last time I updated my rollover IRA all right so on August 10th was my last update which was two weeks ago and then we were at $171,475.86. And the difference is $2,786.42. So another good week. Another good two weeks. So again, this is money that I made as I say, while I was sleeping or doing whatever I was doing, I, I, I can tell you what I wasn't doing. I wasn't sweating. I wasn't huffing and puffing. I wasn't stressing at some job. I was uh, doing whatever I wanted to do in those two weeks and making this passive money. But uh, between the... Between August 10th and today's date, which is the 24th, I did do something in my account and I sold a stock. So what did I sell? Of course, it's not here because it's, I sold it, but let's go find it. So let me scroll up and we're going to go to my account, Transactions. And these are all the transactions I've done for the year. So, uh, cool thing with TD Ameritrade, if you want to go to history, 
and statements you can do month to date one day 60 days out you can go back to a couple of years ago you can view uh, specific dates so right now I have it everything in this particular account for 2020 so let's scroll all the way down to the bottom and I sold a stock on 821 so that was uh, a couple of days ago actually uh, last week today is monday and the stock i sold was nls that's the stock ticker and when i sold it the price was 11.44 per share and i had 147 shares and when i sold everything i cashed out so i sold everything uh almost 1700 so let's scroll up and see when I bought the stock and I bought it uh, what's this June 15th of this year and here's the 147 shares and I paid six dollars and 72 cents and at the time that total was a little under a thousand dollars nine hundred eighty seven and eighty four cents so I made a really nice profit and why did I sell everything and not just sell some of it or why didn't I keep it? Well, this is one of the reasons why you want to look at your portfolio every day. So I got the stock up and the name of the company is Nautilus and they do uh, exercise equipment. So the reason I originally bought it in June, the pandemic was popping. Everybody that I know that went to a gym they were saying their gym is closed or they just didn't want to go. So I said, um, somebody's going to be working out at home a lot more. So I decided to uh, do some research, find out a company or two that manufactured exercise equipment. And I found this company and I bought it. So this was back in uh, June. And I noticed in the last five days, the stock was really falling. So on the... On August 18th, it was at 13.80. And, you know, you can see it, it moving. But at a high level, I'm looking at the five last five days. So we're going back to August 18th. It was pretty much close to $14. And it's just falling. So every day falling, falling. The 19th to 20th is falling. 21st falling. Um, then the weekend hit and then we got today, which is 24 and it's still falling. So when I saw that trend, I decided to sell while I still had profit. So why did I sell a stock? I look at my portfolio every day. Actually, I look at it several times a day. I keep note of my stock prices and I saw this was just falling every day. It was going down and down and down. I knew what I bought it at and I decided to just totally bail out. But I do want to say that I think this is a decent company. And if I was going up and down, like dropped and go up and maybe drop a little bit and go up. So if it was some uh, up and down fluctuating, I would have kept the stock because every day can't be a good day. But when I saw this continuous trend of just falling, 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 I decided to sell. So that's why I sold Nautilus stock, but I still made a really, really good profit. Um, again, I bought it for a little under 1000 and I sold it for $1,681.62. So that's my update for today. Uh, Monday, August 24th, two weeks ago. Um was my last update and I made almost three grand in two weeks doing nothing passive income you guys can do it you can do it better than me please do it it benefits you it's not going to benefit me I'm doing all this stuff to help everyone and I'm not asking for anything all right stocks and rentals.com a lot of good information uh, talking about stocks and I have a lot of good information on rentals.
Yep, we got a lot of articles here. So come and check it out. Knock yourselves out. All right. Ahala. Peace.